Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to another video. So it's been a while guys, I think it's been nearly a week. I'm really, really sorry about that. It's just been, you know, school started and everything and I don't have much time anymore. So I've tried to do like, I'm going to be trying to do like eight videos today. Like just basically just stack up videos for you guys, pre-record them and upload them on the right days. So the next upload is probably going to be on Wednesday and then Saturday, Sunday and then so on and so on. And then after that, when I get like school days off, like weekends, I mean, not weekends, weeks off, like, you know, the school break and stuff, then I'll start uploading a lot more, maybe even daily. So that is what the schedule is going to be, guys. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoy these videos that I'm going to be making today and you will see them later on in the weeks and stuff, obviously. So, yeah, I've got it all planned out and everything for you guys. So you guys are good and are able to watch the videos for Lumber Taking 2 on this channel and uh, yeah so basically as you can tell by the title we'll be checking out Blood GUI so yeah in my previous Blood GUI video I, it was told to me that it was going to be the final update and it looks like it wasn't and it's the another update has come out I don't know how or why um, but basically Audi I think he updated his um, Blood GUI, and if you if you guys don't know who Audi is, he's the creator, and basically Joe Hero is the person who designed the GUI, I believe. So massive shout out to them too. Honestly, yeah, this is one of the best GUIs in the game for Lumber Tekken 2 right now. But yeah, guys. So if you got any other GUIs you want me to check out and stuff like that, then please DM me it in the dis uh, in the car uh, in Discord. Or just tell me down below in comments and I'll check it out for you guys. But yeah, let's get into it. So, I will be using Synapse, guys. You can use anything. You can use any injector. I believe it will work on any injector. And basically, yeah, just go, the link to the script will be in the link in the description, guys. Click on the link and it will take you to the script. And literally just do everything it says and then you'll get the script and then basically you do control v to paste it but before you paste it and everything obviously you need to copy it and you can do that by um selecting it selecting the whole script and then pr doing control c to copy it and then control v it onto your injector and it should look something like this and yeah after that all you need to do is click attach and it should attach your game and yeah, injecting, checking whitelist, and then it should be scanning. Come on. It could take up to like a minute or two, guys, to inject. Actually, not even a minute. It's probably like 30 seconds. Yeah, it's pretty. I suggest you guys buy Synapse X. It's like $20 or £15, pounds, whatever currency you're in, in your country or whatever. And yeah, I it's 100% worth it to get this, guys. It's honestly the best injector out out right now but yeah after that you just execute guys and boom this should pop up this blood ui logo and yeah it, this all should pop up and it, as you can see guys there's a blood logo at the top that's what you need to click to spawn in the gui boom as you can see this is the remodeling of joe hero so yeah massive shout out to joe hero for the awesome awesome remodeling for the GUI, it looks so much better now. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys, it looks really cool. But yeah, it's like a red school that is awesome, honestly. It goes perfect with the blood theme as well. Honestly, this is perfect. But I don't know if Joe Hero made any um, scripting for this as well, I don't know. I think he had a few parts of his scripts and stuff in here as well i'm not too sure but most of it uh, most of the scripting is by audi i believe but yeah let's quickly just check here we've got time so yeah tp to players you can tp to random players obviously yeah pretty average for a gui every single one has it basically so after that oh yeah you can tp to paces as well that's pretty cool um yeah that's pretty cool i guess um what else waypoints guys so waypoints basically in every gui as well which is awesome yeah tp to plot i haven't got a plot spawned in so spawn fancy finishing you can basically go anywhere uh tp to custom location show current 
I don't know. That's like the coordinations. I don't know. I don't see the point in that. I have no idea. But anyway, frost, snow glow. Yeah, this is a snow glow bit. And yeah, shrine of sight. Yeah, whatever, guys. This is pretty average. Let's go back to the spawn. And uh, let's check the next buttons. Uh, wood menu. Let's check this out. So, wood to sawmill. I believe this still works. Gold axe. Let's check this out. Gold axe should be working. It's, it's never patched. So, yeah, we'll just quickly check here out because, yeah, why not? So, if you don't know how to do this, it's basically you get a. Uh, this. What is it called again? Basic hatchet. And you buy it. It's proper cheap. Don't worry about it, guys. And you buy it. Oh, and a fan has joined. Oh, that's awesome. Hello. Co. C O A, uh, I can't read it. C O A S R B 2008. Massive shout out to him for joining. And yeah, anyway, let's get back into the video. So basically, you just open it up, and it should look something like this. Yeah, basically, this is what you what you do. And then you press gold axe, and it says gold axe activated. And then you can press on any tree, and it should cut. Boom! Just like that, guys. One shot. Unless you want to spam me and like destroy every single tea around, and and wood to sawmill on. I don't know how to do this, guys. It's basically I think you press F on a tree or something like that, and press F on your sawmill. I have no idea, guys. Uh, if you want me to look into it, tell me in the comments. But yeah, the well, rest of these are pretty much, um, well, pretty much average for GUIs. Sell planks. You can sell planks in your slot. Uh, sell cut wood you know you can sell the wood that you cut and you can TP wood you have cut down so let's try this boom see these are the wood I cut up there and you can teleport them here so yeah it's awesome and as you can see guys it says teleport to spook as well let's click this out oh my days there's a spook wood tree here no way as if let's try and cut it can you cut it with this oh I don't think you can cut Spook wood with wait, let's try this. Can you cut spook wood with oh my days? You can that's so cool as if there was spook wood in this server. That's awesome. Oh That's epic But oh, I've, I'm still yet to find spook wood trees guys I mean not spook wood sinister trees if you guys have found sinister trees then tell me in the comments down below But yeah, oh my days as if I got this this is awesome, but yeah, it works with a gold axe cutter as well that's op as heck you don't have to waste time you know cutting it with like uh, end times axe or anything you can just quickly cut it with this uh, let me try and tp it to the fan that was in the server so let's go back to the spawn let's go to tp to player uh, tp to player here and then let's go back into wood menu tp wood to you and look at this guys this is the glitch part. It doesn't do anything. Uh, see this, guys? This is the bad part. It just floats. So I suggest you guys don't uh, TP it to your to with the script, basically. Anyway, all right, guys. Anyway, let's carry on with the GUI. Uh, we've checked out wood menu. We actually found a spook wood. It's so common now. What is going on? I've I'm finding so many spookwood trees now. I don't know why it's so common now. I swear it used to be so much more rare back in the day. But maybe it's because I used these exploits and it's super easy now. I don't know. But yeah, it's just every server I go, it's just spookwood trees. No joke. But anyway, let's just go back into the game. I mean, video. Copy menu. You can copy base, you know, blah, blah, blah. We all know about this. Um, anyway, uh, art menu. Oh my days, I want to try this out. Oh, this would be so awesome. Art menu, you, you've got the paint tool here. You can paint if you guys don't know what it is. You can select a random uh, color and you can paint your trees whatever color you want it to. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. Wipe base, max land. Yeah, these are all like something we have. These are all what we checked out already in the past videos. If you guys don't know about this, make sure to watch my past videos. Basically, I did all this in like separate videos and stuff. Um, Lumber Tycoon tools. Obviously, this is the walk speed. So, 
uh, press V, I think you press on it, and yeah, yeah, super fast, jump power, yeah, jump power doesn't increase for some reason, let me put 200, and then press jump power, oh yeah, there we go, that's awesome, uh, grief fly, yeah, I don't suggest you guys do this one, because yeah, it just glitches you out, and it doesn't stop for some reason, but yeah, come on, alright, there we go, oops, turn it off, turn it off, alright, it doesn't let me go down, oh my days, I'll have to restart, re um, not restart, I mean reset my car character, but yeah, walk on water, you have everything you usually have, you can remove fog, which is, so, oh my days, what the, have I got, oh my days, what is going on, what the, what is going on? Let me just rejoin the server, guys. What the? So, yeah, that's basically it for the video. Um, we basically went through everything. Fun time. Yeah, the spray cans. Yeah, these are pretty cool. We've already checked these out. There's really nothing else new other than the spookwood parts. Uh, I'm sorry if I'm wrong. I think that's about it. That's the new update for Blood GUI. I'm not too sure if there's any others if, except from the Spookwood plea. I'm sorry if, if I'm wrong, but yeah, what is the sound of me? But anyway, anyway, yeah, that's basically it for the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and yeah, more GUI uh, showcases and stuff coming soon, guys. And yeah, make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you're new, turn the post notification on so I don't miss another video. And yeah, that's basically it, guys. Like, subscribe, and peace.